light might just seem like something bright to you. But in this diagram you can see light has actually been split into lots of different colours. These are just the colours that our eyes can see. We call this the visible spectrum. Light is a form of energy. It travels from a source, which is in this case a torch, and electrical energy travels in straight lines, always in straight lines. Sometimes we can force light to travel in a different direction. This is called reflection. For example, light, traveling, light energy traveling from a source could hit a mirror and it is reflected into a different direction. So this is an example of reflection. Sometimes light energy travels in a straight line and passes through an object, such as glass. Here is a magnifying glass. It then carries on without any interruption. This energy has been transmitted. And why? Well, it's because of the glass. This glass, which is completely see-through, is transparent. If you think back to the beginning of this video, I showed you the visible spectrum of light. Black was not on it. Black is a shade. It is an absence of light. If I send some light energy from my source, transmit it, it will travel towards the black sheet. But then what? Well, it won't reflect. It won't be transmitted. It would, in fact, be absorbed. But what if I chose some material which colour was on the visible spectrum, such as red? Well, my electrical energy will travel from my source until it hit the material. Some of the energy would, in fact, reflect. Some of the energy would be absorbed into the material. But remember, red is in the visible spectrum. So sunlight energy would be transmitted. And the light energy which was transmitted would appear to, to our eyes to be red.